words can read. Hi guys, it's me again. This is going to be like the last one because the battery is slowly dying and I'll be heading off soon. So I wanted to do another reaction. I didn't really have an August TBR from 2013 because I said that I was going to be reading sequels as well as a viewer's choice. September wrap up as well because for some reason I didn't do a TBR, October TBR, so I'll watch that with you guys. Let's move on to my October TBR. Welcome to the TBR part, this is where I'm going to reveal to you the books that I plan on reading for the month of October. The first three are ebooks I have to review for blog tours, they are in the same week which is near the beginning of October so they take main priority over other books and one of them I'm currently reading is Endless by Amanda Gray, I'm a third through it and I'm thoroughly enjoying it so hopefully it shouldn't take me long to finish that one. The others are My Sister's Reaper by Dorothy Dreyer and Garden of Eden by Kate Cowan. So these are the books that I just mentioned and I'm also currently reading The Darkest Minds by Alexandra Ooh. Rackin so I plan to finish that this month Not and I've I recently read. started House of Leaves by Mark Z. Finish that too. This is a massive massive book and it's an adult book so it's completely written differently to young adult novels so it's going to take a lot more focus than usual so I plan on just reading this slowly throughout the month and I'm currently listening to an audiobook on my mp3 player and that is Unraveling by Elizabeth Norris. I'm 60% through that at the moment so I plan on finishing that this month and then I've got The Fifth Wave by Ray Ooh, Jackson, which is the booktuber book club pick for this month so I plan on reading that and I'm really really excited about that. Now there are books that I want to read but whether I'll get round to them who knows. The first book is Hidden Among Us by Katie Moran. I got this from my library and I'm oh really looking forward to reading this one. And then I've got City of Glass by Cassandra Clare. Oh, no, I've read that one. third book in the Immortal Instruments series. And I really, really want to continue on with this series. And I know that Roberto, my good friend Roberto, he wants to read this with me. So hopefully I can get around to reading that. So that'd be good to share my views with somebody else. So those are the books I plan on reading for October. However, a book came in the mail today that might just change everything. And that is Fangirl by Rainbow Rowell. And it is I've Rowell that. because I tweeted Rainbow and I asked her, how do you pronounce your surname? Because people pronounce it differently. They say Rowell, they say Ruel, they say Rrrr. And I was like, I need to know because I don't want to embarrass myself because I hate it when I butcher people's surnames. And she said it rhymes with towel. So there you go. It's Rowell. So yes, this book might just change everything. But who knows, who knows. If I get time to read that, obviously it'd be absolutely great. But yes, those are the books I plan on reading. So there you have it. Results will be down there for my October TBR. Oh dear, I don't know why I didn't do a TBR, like a proper TBR for August and a proper TBR for September. That's it for all of my reactions so far. So I'm going to head off now because my battery is literally about to die. I thank you for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you've enjoyed the video, if you like these videos and any comments, any thoughts, leave them down below. If you've read any of the pics too, keep smiling, keep reading and be happy. My social media links will be linked below and I'll see all of you wonderful awesome people in my next video. Bye.